Hey guys, what's up? So you want to produce a ton of ethanol. You're trying to produce it in the new world, but you find it takes up a lot of space, even with importing corn and wood. It's just a space hog. It's a big building. It takes a lot of workforce and you just want to find a better way to get ethanol. Well, let me show you a quick and dirty and amazing way to get lots and lots of ethanol that's going to completely change the way you do it and you probably won't ever build an ethanol factory ever again. So, to get started, you're going to want three items. These are the three easiest items to get for this method and it doesn't take a whole lot of setup or anything else like that. What you're gonna to wanna to look for Go into your items tab of the, st of the statistics screen. Be sure you tick the unknown box, search for Schnapps Distillery. You're gonna want these three items. Ferris El Sarami, Sir Lewis Brindley, and a Get Rich Quick Volume 4, The Wasteland. Now Ferris and Lewis are obviously bought from Eli's Harbor. They're very, they're old items. They've been around since the base game. Most everybody knows about them. This is a new item that came with Season 3 High Life, and it is a item that, per, that affects all drink productions, increases productivity by 20%, has a couple of negatives, but the big fun part about it is it increases your ethanol production by one production every four cycles. So every fourth cycle of any drink production factory gives you one ethanol, okay? Now, there are a few other items you could probably get in its place instead. The biggest one's going to be Brother Hilarious, purveyor of monastic mixtures. Uh, he is a little bit more difficult to come by. You know, you either need to craft him at the Institute, get lucky and find him on a rescue mission, get him from a quest, get him at your uh, public mooring or tourist mooring, whichever one you have, or possibly get him from... Uh, on Malking if he's in your game and you take over an island or you get him from a ship drop. He's a little more complicated to get your hands on. But Ferris, Get Rich Quick Volume 4, and Lewis Brindley are all easily purchased from the different traders. Uh, the only one that you need to get from Archie or Isabel is the book. The other two are found at Eli. So get those three items and then you can start this little method right here. So the second thing you need to do is build your layout. So what you're going to want to do is build this monstrosity right here. This is a near max building schnapps layout right here. Uh, this 56 schnapps distilleries. Uh, the maximum is 58. However, I wanted my uh, trade union to be uh, affected by a road so I could get the fourth slot as well as the Department of Labor effect to give an additional 10% productivity. So we have our three items in here. Lewis, the book, and Ferris. Let's turn on one Schnapps Distillery and take a look and see what it's going to do for us. So that one distillery is giving us a bonus of 230%. Pretty good. Pretty good right there. It's giving us seven per minute on the schnapps. It's giving us two per minute on the rum. And the thing we care about is that it is giving us two per minute on our ethanol. So you can already see where this is going. Actually, I, we're at 330%. I forgot that thing wasn't electrified. So yeah. Now we have electricity, so 330%. Let's go crazy, and let's turn them all on. We turn them all on. All 56. 108 tons of ethanol per minute from those 56 schnapps distilleries. That is absolutely absurd. Absolutely absurd right there. Now, some of the downsides is what it takes to maintain that 432 tons of potatoes, okay? You do need a lot of potatoes if you go for the full 56 and you want to produce all of it. Um, 432 tons of potatoes. One potato farm with just a tractor. Just a tractor on a potato farm will produce nine per minute. So that's about 48, okay? 48 um potato farms with a tractor will handle all of those schnapps distilleries 48 is not bad 
but it is a lot of potato farms. It is more workers. You can also import that amount of potatoes. What I like to do is uh, give it a multiply the amount of potatoes I need times 30. The 30 is the 20 minutes it takes to buy us to come to the region and then a 10 minute buffer. You're going to need just under 13,000 potatoes imported. So how you how you handle the potatoes is up to you. Okay, I don't care how you handle the potatoes. You do the potatoes your way. But get the potatoes, you get all this, you're going to be importing, you're going to be making so much ethanol, it's absolutely unreal. Now, of course, I don't have enough workforce for all this. It's a, just over 3,000 farmers for this setup, which is why I recommend using the fourth trade union slot and slotting in something like maybe the printing press that you can get from the Anarchist DLC content. Gives you some more productivity and reduces workforce by 40%. Or get Brother Hilarious. Again, he reduces the workforce by 50% and increases productivity by 50% and gives you more rum. Now, you can use the excess rum and schnapps that you're producing to import the potatoes. So you can create a, a self-enclosed like production chain right here. Make the schnapps, make the rum, export those, import potatoes. However you want to do that. It is an absolutely disgusting system right here. There are other ways to get it. Of course, you can do goat farms or hibiscus in the uh, Land of Lions. Or you could do rum distilleries if you wanted to in the New World. Or you could just stick the single item that affects chemical plants and just stick with ethanol normally. Or you can make a metric butt ton of schnapps and extra rum and get all the ethanol you need right here in the old world and never have to transport it anywhere. So however you want to do it is up to you. This right here is completely disgusting. A hundred tons of this right here per minute and all the schnapps you could possibly want. All right, guys, that's it for me. I hope this right here gave you some ideas of some things you could possibly do to get some extra schnapps. Oh, not extra schnapps. I need some schnapps apparently now. Some extra ethanol and not have to build ethanol factories in the new world anymore. So if it helped you, gave you some ideas, leave a comment and a like down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I've got to turn this off before my economy collapses because of all the potatoes that I don't have. <laughs> God, see you guys in the next one. Take care.